Good morning, guys. Eden time. It should pop up on the screen momentarily. There we go. And we start out with Pandora's box and pageant boy. We could have helped up though. Up. Not bad. I see Birdcage here, and I believe Pandora's box is only gonna be two soul hearts here. We kind of want to hold this till C1 and get a boss item, right? That would be best case scenario. And there's Spoonbender sitting in a random room here. Um, okay. Okay. And there's Humbling Bundle as well. I'd love to get that. Wow, so we just get a random Spoonbender. And that's going to give us homing shots for this run. Our range is not great. Our damage is okay. Our fire rate's a little bit low. So, need a damage and range up against Cent- or Tears and range up. Is there even a tears and range up item? I miss Dolly. What am I saying? We need to miss Dolly. That's the best case scenario. We're going to get a Queen of Hearts for our sacrifice room here. And what kind of seed did we load into, guys? What kind of seed did we load into? Now, I'll tell you what. Let's, uh, we're going to hit, let's see what this Queen of Hearts has for us. Okay, not not what I was hoping for. Probably shouldn't have said something before I checked it out, right? You know, because there's always a chance that it's only a lover's card. That's a bummer right there. That, that is a bummer. Oh, man. I think this, depending on what we get here, this sack room is still hittable, though. I, I think, of course, it's the freaking Duke of Flies, and we, have, we don't have any bombs to actually, you know, go get them. We, we can also use Pandora's box as two extra hits, too. It's like a higher fan card here, so... That might be something that we do. Um, let's see, though. Because, again, getting Humbling Bundle would be, especially early, massive for our economy. In fact, I'd say we'd be set the entire run. And so, let's see here. And we are going to get Torn Photo. It's going to be a Tears and Shot Speed up. The question is, can we actually hit the sacrifice room, right? I mean... I don't know, I was really hoping for a bomb to at least blow up my dono machine so that I could get... We can. We can hit this. We, we can hit this. It's just gonna be... It's just gonna be tighter than we would have liked. That's all. That, that is all. We're just going to have to buy some... We'll probably... Well, we'll see if we can hit all the way to the money. If we get lucky, right? If we get lucky and get an angel deal that has a health up, like, not a, not a sacred heart, but, like, yeah, well, yeah, I mean, sacred heart would be great. Um, the body, right? I need those items, and let's, uh... Let's see here. We're going to buy this heart. See if we get this teleport. And we just got to hope for the best here, guys. Just got to hope for the best. We're not going to get the teleport. We do get Swallowed Penny, though, so wait a minute. And we're going to get the Soul Heart right back. Spawn on the Troll Bombs. Get out of the way. And I think, actually, we are going to be able to hit for this money. Or potentially... And we're going to get out of the way here. The Soul Hearts. And we're going to get the Soul Hearts here. Okay, well... Where can I? I could. I could actually probably. I need to find a place to take damage though. Is there? Did I take out? All, I took out all the fires. I took out all the fires. No shot. Oh my goodness! We could have. If we left a fire, we could have actually gotten humbling bundle. Unless I got lucky and there's one in my item room. No. No. Oh my god. What a bummer, dude. What a bummer. And we just get a world card. Ah. Oh. So not quite what we were hoping, because again, if we keep hitting that sack room, right, we're just gonna we're gonna end up <sighs> Missing Humbling Bundle is gonna hurt. Missing Humbling Bundle is gonna hurt. Still a good start though. I mean look, it could be worse. The world. It could be worse. Let's go ahead and head in and out of our curse room. What a bummer. Ah. Oh. Man. Oh well. Oh well. Shoot. 
And that's why you should always, well, maybe just leave one fire, right, until you've done everything you can. It's just, it's an order of operations issue there. Oh, I'm trolling. I guess we at least got a nickel for it, but... Wait, didn't I have a key in here? Am I crazy? Huh. I am crazy, I suppose. Alrighty, well then. On the move. And there's a key. Surely we don't get hosed out of this, right? I mean, we'd have a really lucky start with Spoonbender to start us off. So maybe my luck was up. What was up? Maybe we flew too close to the sun, Icarus. You got a nice little tears up too. And we uh we might be in some trouble here, ladies and gentlemen. And that we are. Get up there. Oh my goodness. We are we are not gonna be able to get our item room because we got no keys. Or bombs. That's crazy. That's that's a very Isaac thing to have happen. Let's see his birdcage. Help on us get the finish. The consolation prize should give me a bomb or a key here. It's also gonna give me a range up, and we're gonna get a bomb instead of a key. And there's Dead Cat. And yeah, let's start this one off right with nine lives. Let's start it off right, and we're just gonna have to hope that. Well, actually, I'll tell you what we're gonna do. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna check for our. Oh no, we know our secret room's not there. But we're gonna we're gonna bomb this here. To get a key. And there's either going to be a bomber key for sale in here. And we're going to get another key. Which is great. And then we're going to check. How is this just open? Oh, I hit. Okay, I know where my key went. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I, I, I understand what happened now. Okay. Well, this is fine though too. We're going to get number two. Which is going to give us infinite bombs actually. We're going to check this out. We're going to get glass eye. Nice little damage up for us. As well as a luck up. Our range is good now, our luck is good, and our damage is good. We are chilling, and would you look at that? An item pedestal that we cannot reroll. Wow, we're gonna get. Gonna get that dime, though. And let me guess, this was Moving Box, wasn't it? Awesome. Epic, dude. Epic. What a shame. What a shame. Alright, well, that's fine. Good double deal to start off. Still got a home and glass eye damage up. Consolation prize giving us the range up that we need. We're, our, our stats are actually looking great now. And we have homing. So this is this is good. I mean, again, a bummer that we did not get Humbling Bundle. Because it would have... I mean, we would have been set for this entire run. Humbling Bundle is so, so, so good. Um, let's go ahead and clear this guy out. I'm going to get Monster Manual. We'll go ahead and snag that. Why not, right? I know they're also not going to give us a familiar for a floor and... Honestly, if we end up getting Sack Altar, look at that. If we get Sack Altar, we could end up, you know, sacrificing a couple of these guys for some devil items this run. Right? Depending on how many times we've used it for the floor, you know, that counts for Sack Altar. So, hey, cool little synergy if we can make it work. Instead of that nice little 29 cents now, so we are cruising. We are cruising. And interesting little sacrifice room. It could, it could be a potential option here for us. And we get, we're going to we're gonna get restock for cheap. And Diplopia, which I actually want to replace Monster Manual with. I think Diplopia... Mm, piggy Bank would be really good with Swallowed Penny. Piggy bank would be very good, actually. That is tempting. I can't I can't deny piggy bank. Using Diplo on Piggy Bank and Monster Manual on its own is tempting, but I want to see if I can get Piggy Bank just from, you know, going around the floor here. My super secret room was here. Nope. Guessed wrong. Shoot. And again, just all, all, none of this would be an issue if we had Humbling Bundle, right? If we had Humbling Bundle, all of this would have been easy, right? Wait, I have infinite bombs. We're good. What am I talking about? I forgot. 
Check for our secret room there. Check for our super secret room here. And we are in business. That's where number two could be so good, right? Saves you a ton of trouble. There we go. Good if we can get a temperance machine, right? Where was this key? Could, could I get to this key or was it behind? No. Damn. Okay. Again, if we get a temperance machine, that, that would be great. Or a health up here for our boss so that we can go hit the sack room. Kind of hoping for the health up, right? Let's go ahead and be able to get all of these. God, I'm still so bummed about the Halloween bundle. We had it in the bag, guys, and there's a soul eating for us. Okay. Be able to reroll into anything here. And let's take a gander at our last mystery sack. What are we going to get? A little bit of moolah. We're going to get the Fallen for a boss. So we are going to get a Devil item here. I was actually kind of hoping for health up. Of course, that's not going to happen. We actually definitely will be able to get... Uh, at least be able to get Piggy Bank. And we're going to get Ghost Baby. There's Gimpy and Rotten Baby. And we're gonna take both of these. We gonna die once, but we gonna take both of these. And we're gonna soul of eating this, and we're actually gonna get the HP up that we wanted. Okay, hey. We'll take it. Breakfast. Not bad, guys. Not bad. So... You know, actually, we could still go hit the sacrifice room a little bit. Um, so we're going to get a world card for this next floor. We could hit the sacrifice room a little bit. It's doable. It is, in fact, doable. Um, I don't think we're... Uh, well, I guess I could for a little bit of extra money. We might as Yeah, because we'd get money from it with piggy bank. And, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to get the money to buy that soul heart from hitting this sack room. So here we go. Check it out. Go one two punch and Gimpy's actually gonna proc. Fantastic. Mm. And we get a sticky nickel. Wow. Wow. Let's check check for our secret room right here. I think it's gonna be. It should be here. A little bit of extra money for us, not bad. And let's go ahead and do this too. A little bit of this action. Ah. Plenty of money going around. We're going to take our time here. Again, we're probably going to miss our boss rush because we're doing this. But also, again, with Piggy Bank and Swallowed Penny and all these hearts, we do want to try to capitalize, right? We do want to try to capitalize. We want to make sure that we're getting our money back. We also have plenty of chances for Gimpy to actually proc as well and just build up our soul hearts for this next floor. Could potentially get an angel item too. We don't know, right? We do not know. You never know. Gotta take these opportunities when they present themselves on Isaac. Ah. Got a shot for these three pennies next, and then we're gonna need two more hits. So again, we're, it's a little bit of back and forth here, but I always go out of my way to make these plays if I don't lose anything for making them, right? And we're sacrificing time here. Sure, we're gonna miss boss rush. You know, actually, we might not. Now we will. We probably we're probably gonna have to give up our boss rush. So well, is giving up boss rush worth this this sack room, right? And I think it is in this case solely because we have restock and ways, to, like, we're taking damage and we're getting a ton of money here. And, like, two, we're two for one, basically. And we'll see. I kind of hope we kind of want to get here, guys, is the chest. And actually, I'm just going to speed this along and we're going to buy the soul heart here just to make this go a little bit faster. <laughs> we're going to get the TP. We don't need the TP, but we are going to get it. Take that little bit of moolah, moolah, baby. And you know what? Whatever. We're and we're gonna get redemption for it, and that's kind of what I was talking about, guys. <sighs> really? It's gonna make me do that, huh? We're gonna get redemption, which is gonna be really, really good. Um, redemption again. <clears throat> Redemption is going to make it so that when we go into a devil deal, if we don't take anything, right, uh, it's going to give us a soul heart and a damage up on the next floor. So basically from now on, if we get a devil deal, we're going to get guaranteed value to some degree, right? Worse come the worst. Oh, okay. We get a damage up on a soul heart from the next floor. Perfect, right? Perfect. 
Min maxing, guys. Min maxing. It's, I tell you what, we, you know, if we fly through these next couple floors, you know, it's not completely off the table that we could end up with boss rush, right? Oh well, there's curse lost. I, uh, I stand corrected, folks. I stand corrected. There's uh, curse of the loss gonna be the one thing that uh, <laughs> makes this a little bit more difficult. But rot, uh, rot, taking rotten baby was definitely a must. Like rotten baby's damage is gonna be so good for us. One makes you larger pill. We're not gonna want to take that. A couple keys for the road. Not bad. We're gonna find our shop as well. And there's Tarot Cloth in here. Don't mind if I do. I'll definitely take Tarot Cloth. And there's PhD. Oh, man. I mean... I mean, I really want to get PhD. I really, really want to get PhD. PhD could put our stat line over a hurdle here. I, I, di di I could use Diplo on it. I could use Diplo, but I'm not going to. I, again, we want to save Diplo for our Devil Deal. Again, we get, if we get one more guppy item to spawn in, we can use Diplo. There's a library in here. Excuse me. And uh, Satanic Bible is going to make me uh, switch up a little bit here. Again, our fire rate isn't great, but if we could end up getting Brimstone or something like it, right? Our fire rate wouldn't, be, wouldn't matter, right? It would not mean anything. A little bit of weird world generation here. Looks like we went the wrong way, fellas. We went the wrong way, but we did find that library, which is big. And that library is going to be big because we're going to get a devil item now for a boss item. Unfortunately, we are going to have to kiss boss rush and goodbye here. And actually, we're going to take the sun card instead of the world card because they do the same thing, but the sun card's better. Right? Taking that one onto the road. Missing PhD is going to be tough, too. And again, I, 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 I want to reemphasize how easy it would have been to get all of these items had we had hum, had, had we gotten Humbling Bundle earlier, right? That, that was a big miss, and we're going to get Solo Lilith. It's going to give me Robo Baby 2.0. Which I think is worse than Robo Baby 1.0, but... Just <laughs> They're looking to get a little chubby, and as I said, getting Sack Alter would not be that bad. I mean, we'd risk losing ro uh, Rotten Baby, which would suck, but... Again, getting rid of a little chub for a devil item. Not something I would say no to, right? A couple keys to the road. Let's go ahead and check out our boss. Let's see what we get. Again, we're going to get a devil item here, so... Oops. I was looking at a Robo Baby. And can't make it up. Sure. Sure. Ah, uh, do I take Satanic Bible here? <coughs> That's the question, isn't it? I think I will Diplo PhD if I have to, right? I think that's what we'll do. I think we Diplo PhD, we take PhD, and carry Satanic Bible with us down to our uh, next floor. Uh, it should be up here, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. And all right. PhD. And we do not want a Wheel of Fortune card. Get the lovers. We will take the lovers, and we will grab Satanic Bible. We do have PhD. What is this one going to be? One makes you larger. That's what I thought. And come on over here, Satanic Bible. Get me some devil items, guys. And we're actually going to head back in there and snag that those batteries and start building up our health a little bit. Um, again, yeah, Boss Rush is off the table here. But Hush is still on the table, right? You know, I think Hush is more important than Boss Rush, if you ask me. And Okay. Give me my lover's car. What is this? A range up? Range. Don't mind if I do. I actually could use a range up there, so that's fine. And we are going to go in and out of this curse room as well and check out those two pills. See what they can give us here. Telepills and a balls of steel. Balls of steel. I'll take it. 
We will take it. And with that, we're going to head on down. I'm bummed that we have not seen a temperance machine. Like, should we get a temperance machine, guys? We uh, will be in business. Right? We will <coughs> be seeing pretty big returns on our money. And let's check this out here. And there's Miss Dolly. Hey! That's so good for us right there for a couple reasons. The biggest one being, that's a huge tears of it. Now that we have Satanic Bible, right? Our big concern is that we're not going to get boss items that will give us tears ups. And Miss Dolly going to give us a big one at that. Helping us cover that stat. Um, so that's huge, man. That's huge. And There's a dime. Wow. Let will take that. Like I said, imagine that in the temperance machine, guys. I mean... And we're going to get TP to our devil deal. And look at this. Definitely not better than redemption. Now, this might be a triple take here. We're taking fear shot. We're taking Dark Bum, and we are taking Brimmy Bombs. We are taking all of those, man. Absolutely, and we're actually going to let Dark Bum... Oh, got a Gimpy Heart here. We're actually going to let Dark Bum take that Lover's card for us and start to build our health back up, hopefully. Or not. Thank you, Dark Bum. Good stuff, man. That's exactly why I took you. Awesome. And number two is going to work with Brimmy Bombs. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wow. Are you serious? Oh, man. But Brimstone Bombs. I didn't even think of that. Oh, my goodness. That is very good. And actually, Gimpy is going to work very well with Dark Bomb as well. There's a double card. We'll take Bloody Shot Eye. Man, where is my sack altar? We could we could do some work here. Let Dark Bum go ahead and grab this heart over here. Go on, Dark Bum. Yeah, don't play hard to get. Come on now. And look at Brimmy Bombs here. Dark Bum's gonna give me a card again. We <laughs> we don't need the cards, Dark Bum. <clears throat> and my shop is on the way. Perfect. Don't be a greed fight, Dark Bum. You do get a two of diamonds. Justice. Alright, Dark Bum's gonna give me some, some goods there. Devil card, Hermit card. Dude. Well, they, actually, he does give me a Hierophant card here. We're going to pop the two of diamonds for later. And actually, because it's only Depths 1, I know the Inverse of the Fool looks good. We're going to take the Hermit, and I, I want to take the Hermit because I want to guarantee my next shop, right? I want to guarantee my next shop. And this Hermit card with Terra Cloth is going to do just that. Look at the Brimmy Bombs here. <laughs> Brimstone number two, man. And that's going to be another Guppy item, and we're lucky that we actually miss our Devil Deal here. We're gonna have a hundred percent chance on this next floor, and that's good. We're making decent time. Like we're we're moving along, but um, we are gonna miss boss rush. Like I said, and there's nine volt. We're absolutely taking nine volt. That's gonna be really good. And the smelter too. I'm actually gonna take and use, and we're also gonna pop this. Yeah, thanks for butt punching, game. Number two, going in. We'll take, we'll take the golden heart here. And those are some good items, man. Uh, do I, I don't want a fruitcake. We don't want fruitcake. Oh, gosh. We do get to telepills and let Dark Bum get on over here. And maybe it's like I said, I think best case scenario, we get Sacrificial Altar. We could, I mean, it'd be risky to lose Dark Bum, yes. Although Dark Bum has paid itself off already, to be fair. So if we do lose Dark Bum, that's sad. Or Rotten Baby. But it would have paid itself off. Dude, okay. But it's, it's It hasn't been consistent. It paid itself off by giving me a, 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 a Hierophant card. <laughs> we definitely found our boss over yonder. And number two with Brimmy Bombs, man. I never thought I'd see this synergy. And look at us. <laughs> and I'll tell you what. I think we're good to go. I don't, I don't really care what else is on the floor. And that's some damage, man. There we go, finally. 
the dead center. Look at that. That's going to kill something. We're going to take the negative. And there's Goathead as well as Ouija Board. Ouija Board going to be great because it's going to max out our tiers. And again, that's going to cost us quite a bit of health. But we're guaranteed two more Devil Deals with Redemption. So we're going to get something. And Ouija Board is going to give us Spectral Tears and max out our Fire Rate, which we desperately needed to have happen. And we're one off the Dumpster too, by the way. We are one off of the Gupster. Our challenge room's over here. That Dark Bomb, grab that Dark Bomb. I'm gonna, need, I'm gonna need you to start giving me some health. Not Telepills. It's gotta be health, Dark Bomb. No more of this nonsense where, you know, I'm not getting health. I need, I need health. Lucky Sack. I guess I'll take... We can take Lucky Sack as well. And there we go. I'm an idiot. I did not see that that was a uh, trap chest. That's an Isaac, Isaac Classic right there. That is an Isaac Classic moment. <laughs> You'd love to see that. Oh, it looks like we... Wow. Okay. Okay, am I not going to get a bomb spawn in here? Just checking for my secret room over here, guys. Come on now. Oh, God. I'll tell you what. Here's what we're going to do. Do I have time? I think I do. I should have time here. I I, I do want to check out this chest, and we're going to pop this chariot card to do so. Just a bit of money. And I was hoping for some help for Dark Bomb. But again, Gimpy is actually, Gimpy is, you know, killing these guys, giving them, they're dropping some hearts, right? Which is good, because Gimpy, again, has the effect where enemies will sometimes drop half red hearts. No, no, no. Excuse me? How? So someone watch that back for me, please. What just happened? Was that, was that... My own bomb had to have done that. I'm gonna get a full card, and I guess we'll hold on to that. And let's take on our boss here. Lovely. There we go. Let's see what we end up getting. Black powder. And there's Sack Alter, man. So here's the good news. We're gonna take... Uh, I actually think we take the mark first. And then we take Sack Alter second. And luckily our Devil Deal is going to stay open. And we don't lose Dark Bum. We do lose Rotten Baby though. So that kind of sucks. At least we keep Dark Bum. Um, but I will take Eye of the Occult because we need the damage. And I guess I'll take Little Abaddon. Not what we were hoping for. Oh boy, we have PhD. I can see Feels like I'm walking on Teleshine. That's that was so good, Smile. Just what I needed. And okay, well, at least we kept Dark Bomb, but still losing Rotten Baby is not good. We did get Eye of the Occult, which does help us with damage a little bit, right? Um, but it's not quite what we Justice. wanted. Dude, are you kidding me? Dark Bomb, what's been going on, man? I need more from you here. And I don't, I don't think we'll be able to fight Hush like this, guys. I'll be honest with you. It's freaking number two doing that right there. Wow. What am I watching? What? Wow. We'll make it through this, but, it, you know, it, this, is, this is a little silly. I'm being honest with you. It's getting a little silly over here, folks. Actually, I should not have taken Eye of the Occult because it's going to override my homing. I'm, I'm just not focused up today. What was I... What was I doing? We just basically lost our Spoonbender. 
We didn't lose it, but... And they still, they still kind of home in, right? Oh, come on. You've got to be shitting me. The fuck is that? Jeez Louise. Jeez Louise, man. Let's find our boss room. Thank you. Dark Bomber's just not been doing it for us today. Oh, we do get Succubus from Cambian Conception, though. That is good. Wow. And we, uh, we we just can't. Unfortunately, guys, we just we cannot take on good old Hushy here. We are going to get a damage up, though, from Redemption. Close the Soul Heart right back. We'll take that. Those, we'll take those for sure. And my own bomb, yet again. And I am going to check this. I, I really want to get that Guppy, right? Really want to end up getting Guppy, but... It's looking grim for that possibility. It's, it's not looking good for that, that's what I'll say. It's, it's looked better. And Dark Bum, I need you to start being a little bit better for us. I need big things from you, Dark Bum. I need big things from you, because we sacrificed Rotten Baby. That's why, you know, definitely one of those runs where I shouldn't have taken Ivy Cole. It's just a bummer that Sack Alter just gave me another familiar as well as Ivy Cole. But, I mean, again, we, we kind of needed the damage from Ivy Cole, I will say. I took it for the damage stats. We did not have Succubus at that time, so there's no way for us to get consistent damage out. And we'll, like, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Again, we have Dead Cat, so... Not even gonna, not even gonna bother with that room. I don't think. No need to even worry about it, folks. Finally, we get a temperance machine. That's kind of funny, actually. Took our sweet time getting it, though. Holy cow! I will say, number two with Brimstone Bombs can do a lot of damage to us. We just have to be aware of it, right? Come on now. We just barely missed him. And here is our boss. Again, we do have Spectral Tears, so I, I do want to do a better job actually utilizing Spectral Tears. Let's see, ready? Here we go. A little bit late on my part there. I was trying to I was trying to time the brimstone bomb. Number two. Look at that damage. There we go. Now we're talking. And that's some big damage. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Re brimmy bombs, dude. <laughs> really, brimmy bombs. <clears throat> Same in this run. Honestly, I mean, wow. That's why we love Brimstone Bombs. Now, let's see. We just need one more for Guppy. If we get Guppy, I'm really confident. We'll have a ton of damage, right? Our health actually is looking good over here. It's looking much better than I thought it was. We're going to take Horror Babylon. I don't know if I'm... I don't think I'm going to take Death's List here. Normally, I would. Actually, no, I am. I am. Who am I kidding? Oh, well, I guess maybe not. What am I watching happen in front of me here? I am going to take Death's List, actually. I, 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 I'm not, I wasn't sure if I could get it to get, va get value here, right? How are you still alive, my God? But I'm pretty confident that I can. Oh, come on, dog. Nice, Dark Bum. Nice. Nice, Dark Bum. Good stuff. 
Oh, we get golden dice bag. Yo. We could reroll our entire run here. And that's what I actually think I'll do. Again, we have a ton of devil items that we're going to be able to roll into if we get a D4. Are you fucking serious right now? I guess we got golden dice bag from that, but that's unbelievable. There's D20. Satanic Bible. Okay, we just, we just need a D4, man. Might as well D1 that. And I, I will definitely D4 here. I think we can get some good stuff. And there's D4. Let's see. We get conjoined, we keep dead cat, we get tiny planet, it looks like a mob of void. Oh my god, with holy shot though. What do we end up getting? This looks kind of crazy. Dead cat, Judas' shadow, holy shot, money equals power, spirit of the night, the battery, PhD, mob of the void. Hey. Not bad, actually. Usually I would not be a big fan of Tiny Planet over here, but it's uh, with Holy Shot. We're actually able to put in some work, and there's a movement speed up that we needed, so we're just going to go ahead and do this right now and go crazy. We just line it up just like so. So we can stay in the Void range, and that's a ton of damage. Wacky run today, but we made it work. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you all. Whew! Tough one. We squeezed through it, though. I'll see y'all next time. Really fast start, but not, not quite the finish we'd hoped for. But that's all good. I'll see y'all next time. Peace out, fellas.